My people, oh, wonder shall never end. Kabi esi. Oh, Kabi esi. I de hear you, my dear. I de hear you because you are doing a great job. Very good one at that matter. Yes, so, my correct people. We heard allegedly that Kabi esi is now asked to show these people that if you don't want to leave, you must live by fire by force. If you don't want to leave Queen Naomi to do her work as the madam of the house, that will, be, that will come by fire by force because... They said that allegedly that Kabi AC introduced when Naomi and the Olori Dr. Elizabeth as his only wife. <laughs> of course, they are his only wife because these other ones are knife, if you ask me. So, there's this hospital, they call Equity Hospital, that Kabi AC uh, opened newly. He said that they are, he's going to launch it this month. I think 16th of this month, he's going to launch the hospital officially. And this hospital, hmm, Equity Hospital, KBSC equipped this hospital to, to, the, as in, to the latest. The kind of equipment that is there, uh, some of these ones that if, if anybody gets sick, if some people that have money get sick, they will rush their, their person to outside the country where they are going to receive proper treatment with good equipment. It's that kind of equipment that they said that KBSC equipped that hospital with and again there is this thing he, he did he said that if anybody that comes to that place is going to if that person doesn't have money immediately you can treat that person whenever the person have money the person can bring it's not that if you don't have money they will not treat you or you don't deposit any money any amount of money they will not treat you that they consider poor people so in that hospital it's not because of the equipment are costly or equipment are good that is only the rich people will be going there for treatment. No. If you are poor, you can go there. If you are rich, you can go there. And they have beautiful and good equipment. And he employed uh, qualified doctors and nurses to be taking care of patients there. Hey. So there is these people, these uh, clients that he have from outside the country that came to uh, for this equity hospital. You know, when something of this nature is there, some people used to go to, I don't know how, like say, even if it's in education, you will say that there are supervisors who go to schools to check textbooks, check uh, uh, things, check in social materials they use to teach children. Mm -hmm. I think there is people that also come to hospital to check the kind of equipment that they have in, the, in that hospital. Whether it is qualified to, to be used for patients, whether they can be using that equipment very well to cure people's sickness, you know, that kind of thing. So these people, they come from outside. And the KBAC <laughs> and Kunomi and Dr. Elizabeth, this three is the people that I know as husband and wife. Others are uh, people that have come to achieve one mission or the other. So my career people know, hmm. Because of the fact that KBSC have given Tadene Kawo, it's not just because of that though. 50% of every of his investment. You know that this hospital, KBSC, uh, Kunomi and Tadene Kawo have 50%. Dr. Elizabeth, I don't know how much he have for this one. But they said that uh, those clients that came, KBSC called Dr. Elizabeth and Kunomi. Only these two. And they introduced to these people that these are my wives <laughs> these are my only wife and the thing that got some of these oloris not not some of them all of them the thing that got olori mariam blue blue uh, uh where, where are they actually uh temito with them and the tiktok <laughs> the one that got them mad is that kabi said that these are my only two wife <laughs> Only two wife, oh. and they were like, Does it mean that KBS no longer see us as wife? Now, why would KBS introduce Quinomi and Dr. Elizabeth as his only wife? You know, they were they have been crying you know, as we heard it allegedly. That they have been crying, saying that this is not what they expect, that this is marginalization. This is this marginalization is too much for them, they cannot bear it again. And I was like, You won't blame this man now. You will not blame KBAC. KBAC knows what he's doing. KBAC knows that you too, you all always, you have your children with your different husbands. And all of you, your husbands are still there. 
Tomorrow you can choose to go back to your husband. If there's any of this thing that KBC gives to you, you can take it back to your children and take start managing it, using it to train your children. But you see, Dr. Elizabeth and Queen Naomi, this is the only two that KBC have. Dr. Elizabeth is not going to leave Queen Naomi to uh, KBC tomorrow. She's married to him. If not that they, they said that she had us, uh, she miscarried her baby the other time. She for them they expect to give birth very soon. And God will, will bring another one. Is it for Kunomi? Kunomi have Tadeniko already. And the more Tadeniko's siblings are, here to, are, are still coming. They will still come. Is it Blue Blue? Blue Blue, she have her children with her ex-husband. Even her children are grown up. So she can actually get all of these things. Even that, uh, uh, that company that she's managing. She can naturally sell it off one day. Because you don't know what she, they can do. She, they have great plan. They have evil plan against KBAC. So KBAC introducing Queen Naomi and uh, Dr. Elizabeth as his only wife. You can't blame him. He's doing a great job. He did what he's supposed to do. Because this is only two that he has. So these people, they have been crying. They have been weeping. They have been saying that KBAC is too much on us. So you cannot bear it again. But if you don't bear it, you leave. KBC have told the uh, Antigui that if she wants to leave, she can leave. Her husband used to come to the palace almost every time to disturb KBC. KBC have told her to leave. Go back to your husband. Your children need you. Oh, which kind of thing be this one? If they come to the public, they will feel as if uh, they are with KBC. They, they love KBC. They will hold KBC the other hand. They will kiss him. They will do, the, do him this, do him that. After all of that, fa 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 fa. Look at Auntie. Uh, is it Auntie Blue Blue? Had it mean she have her way, she would have dethroned KBAC long ago. So what do you expect KBAC to introduce them to his client as wife, a be as business associates, a be business partners? I'm, I'm not seeing it working that way. I'm not seeing it working that way. So I congratulate KBAC. At least with all of this thing now that he's doing to them, if they want to leave, they can leave. If they don't want to leave, let them stay there and be receiving heartbreak. <laughs> anyway, share my career people. <laughs> now, so I take care of them. But if it is true, I help KBAC. Be but, but come to think of it though. Now, KBAC brought all of this in upon himself because he knew that these women, are, these women are already married. But he still went and married them. Although, if he start now to amend things, he don't, he don't know that they, they are going to turn out to work against him like this. If he starts now to amend his ways, it is going to be better. So guys, that is the gist though. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget that all of these are all alleged information. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe. If you have not given my video a thumbs up, please I beg you to give this video a thumbs up and share it. Say your mind at the uh, comment section. And don't forget that they are alleged. Love you guys. Bye.